Up and Adam on a Thursday morning, 621. That means time for the power for your pocketbook. We like this because this gal just started out as a mom trying to save her family some money. Now she is one of the premier coupon experts in the country. Joining us this morning live from Atlanta, Jill Cataldo, known as the Coupon Queen. Good morning. Thanks for sharing time with us here in Oklahoma today. Good morning. Thanks for having me. It's National Coupon Month, and Jill, you save up to like 60 bucks a week on groceries. Okay, you got to give us the secrets. How do you reap these rewards? Well, you know, when I first started coupon shopping, I realized very quickly that anytime we can pair our high-value coupons with low sales prices, we're taking things home very inexpensively or at times free. Perfect case, if I have a dollar coupon, I'm going to wait till there's a dollar sale. Dollar coupon, dollar sale, I'm taking that item home for free. All right. And I try to do that with just about everything that I buy. You save thousands of dollars all year long on groceries and helping people find things for free. But when I heard that you get the stores to pay you to shop, I'm thinking, okay, now I want to know how she does that. It's the same kind of thing. You know, a lot of our stores will have these promotions where, you know, it's buy these items and get $10 off your next shopping Mm -hmm. trip. Those prices, if we can bring them down with our coupons even more to the point where we're paying 10 and getting 10, or sometimes let's say you're paying 8 and getting 10, now the store is essentially paying you to shop too. What about getting brand names? Because it seems like sometimes coupons might not be for the items that are maybe the more popular ones or the ones that we like. How do you get them for the brand names? Well, there are a lot of brand name coupons out there. You know, they're actually, it's kind of a myth. There are a lot more brand name coupons than there are store brand coupons. And the other thing you might not realize, too, is there's coupons. We talk about groceries a lot because that's kind of my, my bread and butter, but there are a lot of coupons out for non-grocery things, too. You know, you can find coupons for airline travel, hotels, restaurants, all this kind of thing. My favorite place to find those kind of coupons is in the entertainment book. And, you know, that's one of those things that kind of really pays for itself because there are just mm-hmm. so many coupons in there. Let me ask Locally you, for you oh, yes, go real ahead. quickly, because you're a mom of three. You know, our lives are so busy. We've got to do everything from taxi cab to make sure the house is great. How important is being organized in our uh, coupon gathering? You know, being organized is definitely key, but this doesn't take as much time as you would think. Okay. Every, every week, I'm spending probably half an hour to an hour on this, but I'm saving, you know, easy 50 to 70% a week on groceries. Wow. All right. Well, hey, we're going to link your website to all our viewers this morning. Jill Cataldo from Atlanta, thanks for uh, sharing those secrets with us here on News 9 this morning. Thank you so much. All right. This segment uh, with Jill brought to you by Entertainment Guide. She is read by over 11 million people each week around the nation. So I'm going to link her website to the Power for Your Pocketbook page. Let me show you how you get there. Very easy. Go to News9.com. Click there. And then go over to the right. Seen on News 9. Power for Your Pocketbook. There it is.